Archbishop Emeritus Desmond Tutu, who turns 85, or rather turned 85 yesterday, has said that uh, when the right time comes, he would want an option of an assisted death. The arch, as he is famously called, has been recovering at home after a minor surgery for a recurring infection last month. Now, in a column in the Washington Post, Tutu said he believed in the sanctity of life, but also reiterated his support for assistance dying for terminally ill people who seek that option. His exact words were, and I quote, I have prepared for my death and I've made it clear that I do not wish to be kept alive at all costs. I hope I am treated with passion and allowed to pass on to the next phase of life's journey in the manner uh, or rather manner of our choice and dying people should have the right to choose how and when they have they leave um, a mother earth. I pray that politicians, lawmakers and religious leaders have the courage to support the choices or rather choices a terminally ill citizen that make a departing mother earth. The time to act is now, unquote. Dear sisters and brothers, as a Christian, I believe in the sanctity of life and that death is a part of life. I hope that when the time comes, I am treated with compassion and allowed to pass on to the next phase of life's journey in the manner of my choice. My friend, Lord Carey, has passionately argued for an assisted dying law as to similar initiatives in my home country, South Africa, in the United States, New Zealand, in parts of the European Union and right across the world. People who are terminally ill should have the option of dignified and compassionate assisted dying alongside the wonderful palliative care that already exists. I pray that politicians, lawmakers and religious leaders have the courage to support the choices terminally ill citizens make in departing Mother Earth with dignity and love. Now, Tutu is one of the most uh, revered religious leaders and social justice activists in the world. He was awarded the Nobel Peace Prize in 1984 for his crusade to eradicate apartheid in South Africa.